The overall goal of this procedure is to produce mutant fish using gene-breaking transposon vectors with GAL4-VP16 as the primary gene trap reporter. This is accomplished by first co-injecting the gene trap vector along with TAL2 transposase into zebrafish embryos. Injected embryos are screened for GFP fluorescence at three days post-fertilization, and approximately 30% of the brightest embryos are selected to establish the F0 pool. Next, the F0 fish are crossed to the UAS MRFP tester line to screen for germline transmission of gene trap events. The final step is to outcross the F1 to establish the F2 generation and to generate embryos for molecular characterization of gene trap events by inverse PCR and 5' race. Ultimately, about 1 in 10 screened F0 fish should produce gene trap progeny. Gene breaking transposons were designed to produce no mutations upon integration into introns of protein coding genes. Our GBT vectors use GAL4VP16 as the primary gene trap reporter. This modification increases sensitivity for genes expressed at low levels and makes it possible for us to use gene trap mutants without overt phenotypes as GAL4 drivers for tissue specific expression of other transgenes. We believe the main bottleneck of our method is in achieving sufficiently high rates of gene trap integration in the germline of F0 fish. In this demonstration, we will cover several critical steps DNA preparation, microinjection, and F0 screening. 